High school students volunteering for drug and alcohol tests in exchange for discounts at local businesses. It's happening in at least two Sarasota County schools. ABC 7's Ray Collins has details of this fast growing program. Ray. Yeah, Haley, an incentive program is growing right now on the Sun Coast in the high schools. Students actually sign contracts and then take drug and alcohol tests in exchange for a discount card. While the Sarasota Sailors loosen up on the field for a spring scrimmage, there's another group hanging out behind the bleachers. These are just some of the 380 students of the drug-free youth group at Sarasota High School. It's the largest group on campus and still growing. So what is it? It's an initiative to entice kids and support kids to make the decision to be uh, drug and alcohol free. And to do that, they participate by doing a drug test to get in the program and they get a photo ID card. And those ID cards are good for discounts at local businesses, which one student says is better than all the pep talks in the world. I think when you present, you know, something where you can, hey, here's my DeFi card and you can go over to your local food places where, you know, kids are always spending so much money and losing so much money, you know, and they can give their card and, you know, save some of that money. It just it gives you like ultimatum almost to to really stay away from it. And I think it's a big it's a big opportunity. Do you think drugs really are a problem in high schools? I do. Like, there are a lot of kids that are going down the wrong path, and it's just, if, like, this program really, like, gets started in a bunch of different schools, I think it can really help people. Chloe Madden there on the right and Kaya Evans are here from Riverview High School checking out Sarasota's growing program. So I'm on student council, and so next year we're going to have a club start there and have it spread to review and hopefully other high schools. So nearly 400 students have signed up already in Sarasota at the high school there. And in Northport, 1,600 kids are on the drug-free youth program. Haley, good start. That's encouraging. So did this program begin here in Sarasota County? Not exactly. A Northport parent actually heard about it in Idaho and brought it back here to this area. This was the first full year at Sarasota High School. Sounds very successful so far. All right. Thank you, Ray.